Holm. One and two on Jackson, the center fielder. Garrett delivers. Splitter swing and a miss. He struck him out of the inning is over. Junior Garrett with a good stop of the first strikes out back-to-back -back hitters. Nothing across for far. Batter with a wide open stance. The 0-1 pitch. Swinging a little looper out toward short tough play. That's over the head of Penn Prays. A base into the wing. That's will take the lead. Kahalali all around third will score in the wing. That's have a 1-0 advantage here in the bottom half of the first inning. Good piece of fitting by John Rodriguez. 13 homers tied for 11th in the league. 49 RBI. Swinging a broken back rider past Garrett. Tough play. Corey Fairhands throws the first, and it's in time to get Alberts, and the inning is over. Great play by Ryan Corey to end the inning. A slow roller past the mound. Corey charged in, barehanded, threw off balance to first, and they get Albert Jackson. Runners lead from all three bases. Garrett comes set. 3 2 pitch. Swing and a miss. He struck him out. Enormous strikeout for Junior Guerra. Comes back from a 3-0 count to strike out Ronnie Berkman. And Guerra is set. And the payoff pitch. Fastball in there for a called strike three. Nine strikeouts for Junior Guerra. Penprace thought he had ball four. Hinton currently second in the league in ERA. Another 2-2 pitch. Swing and a miss. He struck him out. Junior Guerra strikes out 10 batters for a third consecutive start. He fans Nick Jackson on a two and two splitter. 10 strikeouts for Guerra, no runs, no hit. Cleveland to win the seventh. The pitch swing and a foul tip held by Armstrong for strike three. Junior Guerra sets a new career high with his 11th strikeout of the night. One away here in the eighth. Anthony Capper and Justin Clip to lead this rotation. Line drive, one hopper, back hit by Corey. Spins, fires to first. The dig by Ziegler is in time to get Alberts, and the inning is over. Ryan Corey with an amazing play to finish up the top half of the eighth inning. A sharp one hopper in the hole. He backhanded, spun around. Rackhold holding on. Rodriguez at first. The pitch to Ziegler. Fastball, high fly, ball deep left center field. Back goes Jackson onto the track. He's at the wall, and it's gone. C.J. Ziegler with a two-run homer to left center field off the bottom of the scoreboard. And it cuts the lead of 5-4 here on the bottom of the ninth inning. Ziegler's 24th home run of the year, which... Yeah, just unfortunate. You know, one inning, they get the five. They get all five in one inning. Start out with a defensive kind of blunder there where Z made the bad throw to the plate. So, you know, like I said, as long as we learn from our mistakes, then that's fine and we're going to make mistakes. The ball bounces that way sometimes. We made a run there at the end. We didn't do a whole lot offensively in between. We had some opportunities there, I felt, to score, and we just didn't do a whole lot. Made a good run at the end, and we were in a ball game. So it's over with. You know, Chalk this one up, and unfortunately we fell one run short, but you got to come back and bounce back and be ready to go tomorrow. Yeah, Jude, you're tremendous there once again. Tonight. Yeah, he was spectacular. Shoot. He looked really, really good once again. And like I said, you know, and then he, he gave up the single and then a couple bloops. Ball in right field, I thought that maybe could be caught too, and we just didn't get to it. So, just some defensive blunders I felt, kind of some some looping balls that fell in that, you know, maybe we had a chance to catch and didn't. So that's the way the ball bounces sometimes, like I said. But bounce back, be ready to go tomorrow, and uh, try to take care of business tomorrow night.